Alright, what's better one? Pathfinder here, and today we're playing some more uh, Killing a Flora 2, but before we start playing uh, Killing a Flora 2, I decided because you guys really want me to open some stupid ass crates, or should I say USBs, and here we freaking go, man. I got two Horzine First Encounter USBs, and two Victorian ones. Now, I picked this one because you can actually get a precious demolitionist skin, but knowing my terrible luck in this game with crates, I'm probably going to get a battle scarred freaking welder, but yeah. Because it's it's actually actually an option. But for the Victorian I mean as far as the Victorian goes, oh just like the A12, the I mean pretty much everything as long as it's mint. But if it's not going to be mint, I'm actually going to cry myself to sleep. But yeah, without further ado, let's start with the Victorian man. Please! Something! Oh, Feel tested, not that good, but it's what I wanted. Oh my god, we're off to a fantastic fucking start, man. Okay, let's open this one up, please. Okay, if I shout real loud, it's gonna give me something cool, please. I don't know, it's gonna give me jack shit. Okay, well. Okay, I'm actually afraid. Let's just use this one. Fuck it, let's see what it's gonna give me, please. Something good. Oh, wait. Feel tested, well, thanks, man. Very much appreciated. Okay, my last crate and key, please. Gold, that's not gold. Oh, but at least it's meant. Horzine first encounter meant. Okay, well. Okay, so what did I get? I got... Uh, what's it called? This one? Looks cool, a bit beat up, but I can live with it, I guess. I got the freaking boomstick Victorian, which is kind of nice. This is just like complete trash, but I don't really mind all that much, but this one, I mean, I don't use the A12 all that much, so this is going to be a freaking sad ass experience. And did I make a profit? Let's go and check out. After looking at the Steam market, this is worth 250, this is worth 220, this is worth freaking 18 cents. I mean, what the fuck even is this? And this is worth... 250 as well, so I spent 10 euros on these four fucking shits and I didn't make a profit. Hooray, would you know it? Gambling at its finest. But yeah, this is. I, that's why I don't like to do like unboxing videos because they're just complete bullshit. Okay, in honor of me getting the AA12 and the boomstick, I'm actually going to play around as the support, so let's see how this is going to pan out. Okay, so I just realized that I unboxed four support weapons, so I'm just going to be doing today Play What You Unbox, episode freaking 2, man. And let's play the freaking support. And I'm going to show you the other A12 skin at the end, if you guys are interested in that. Oh my god, what the hell is even this skin, man? I mean, at least I can see the Horzine logo on it, that's like... Kinda good, I guess, maybe, possibly, but it's still battle scarred, so I don't even freaking care about the skin. And on top of that, it's even only freaking 18 cents to sell it, so rest in pieces, man. Even the freaking bullets are battle scarred. How sad can this be, right? Okay, is that a freaking bloat? Bloat? Come taste my freaking battle scarred bullets, man. You know you like them. There we go. I mean, at least with the support, you can just, like, penetrate through Zeds and kill, like, Zeds behind the Zed that you actually kill. So that's kind of cool. But yeah, I'm just going to be playing today Play What You Unbox, and it's kind of a good one, because I can play pretty much all support weapons at once, because I did unbox the SG-500, which I'm using right now, unbox the Boomstick, which I would, like, normally use, and then the AA-12, and two AA-12s for that matter, so yeah. I'm just going to be using the one that I freaking wanted from the Victorian crate. Okay, Clots, what the hell? Get demolished, man. Oh god, this is just going to be freaking sad as hell. Okay, Clot, what the hell are you even trying there, man? And you are demolished. Well, this skin, is it a keeper? Hell fucking no, I'm actually, going, I'm actually considering about recycling this piece of garbage. But yeah, skipping the trader and be right back. And we are back for the second wave, and this is the freaking boomstick. I mean, to be completely fair, it doesn't look too 
terrible for a field tested skin. I mean, I've I've seen worse. Don't get me wrong, but this one, the only noticeable thing I can see is like on the top there. It's a little bit beat up, but other than that, looks pretty freaking sick. So I give this skin a pretty freaking good thumbs up. I mean, for the mint, you pretty much pay like three euros more, but. If you are a bit cheaper like I am, then the field tested is the way to go. But dude, I just want to unbox a precious skin that I'm freaking done with this life, man. I just want like a precious one, but getting that is going to be a freaking pain in the ass. Oh god, stalkers, I don't really care about you right now. But yeah, freaking double barrel, man. I usually just use the double barrel for the support, maybe even like the survivalist. So, the boomstick skins... I really want a man. Just hope this was like mint though, but you can't always get what you ask for. Okay, Siren need to die, man. Oh god, that's a whole lot of husks and taste my freaking grenades, man. And of course, no one died from them. Because why the hell would husks ever die? Well, that was like a snipe and a half. Okay, anything behind? There's nothing behind, so I can just like kill you guys off. There we go. Clot, not like this. And Gorefiend demolished. But yeah, I do pretty much like this skin. It's kind of cool. And I'm playing Zed Landing because... You know, the, this is like pretty much the best map to show off skins. Because it's like lit up and shit. And thank you to the guy who... Who said that I should play this map. Pretty freaking appreciate it. Oh god, that's a lot of spiders behind. Okay, there's only two left, so... Easy. Well, I guess I can buy the AA-12 with my boomstick, so yeah, skipping the trader and be right back. And we are back, and this is what the AA-12 looks like. I mean, this is the kind of skin that you actually want in, like, mint, because of the, like, freaking cool-ass artwork on it, but... As I said, you don't always get what you ask for. I mean, I pretty much got what I asked for, but it was, like, in the wrong freaking condition, but... Still, pretty freaking cool. But yeah, I, I should probably be using the A12 like a bit more in my support. Because with the support, I usually just go the SG500 and I sell that shit, get the boomstick and get the M4 shotgun because it was like recently buffed and shit, so it's actually cool. And I go for the RPG just to kill like a large group of Zeds fast and maybe even headshot a few Skrix in the meantime. So that's pretty much my support loadout, but I should be using the AA-12 more often with him. Probably. Oh, is that Skrek? I can actually test my boom stickiness on him. I think it's like actually a one-shot in solo, I'm not exactly sure, but I think it is, yeah. I mean, we'll just like test this shit out right now. Or maybe if I just like shot him two times with the AA-12, should be fine. Okay, let's just kill off all you guys now because you are annoying. Okay, let's kill one guy with the A12 just for the honor of the skin. And let's kill the other guy with the boomstick because reasons. Okay, dude, this is actually so freaking powerful for solo. And the freaking Skrake is demolished. Oh, the support, man. I just don't give this perk much. The, the love it freaking deserves, man. Okay, Husk, don't you be doing your freaking flamethrower, man. Oh, and the volcano exploded as well. Kind of awesome. Okay, skipping the trailer and be right back. And we are back for the fourth wave. And as this is the freaking play what you unbox, I I am forced to play with these three weapons. So that's kind of like cool. I mean, all the other play what you unbox are probably going to be like one weapon specifically because I don't have that much money to spend on every play what you unbox. So yeah. Okay, let's just kill you guys up because you are freaking annoying to say the least. Okay, I actually want to try something with the bloat. Let's see if I can actually just like... Oh, I can. That's kind of neat. Oh, but he still puked me anyway, so that doesn't even matter anymore. Okay, what do we got? We got a raged flesh bound and we got some scrakes. So let's just headshot this guy really quick and then just run away with the boomstick. Because that's what you do with the boomstick. Oh god, the support for Soul is just so freaking powerful, man. Oh, well, time to jump over you guys and run away. Because that's what you do with the boomstick. Okay, Scrake, I don't want your freaking shenanigans here, so I'm just gonna kill you up. Because that's what you do. Oh god, I just 
I mean, I'm not like overly used to this thing, but I see why people use it. It's kind of like awesome. And I do hate how it fires like two times. And I do hope they actually fix this bug in this like Halloween update. Okay, what the hell are you and guys trying here, man? Doesn't make sense. I mean, I just kind of like the A12 and the boomstick. They're just kind of like good together, I guess. But, I mean, I was kind of like used to playing with like the RPG and shit. And I mean, just look at this. This level 25 skill with A12, it's just so freaking broken. Okay, well, boss time, and I only have to use these three weapons, and yeah, skip the trailer and be right back. And we are back for the boss, now I'm hoping for a patriarch or I'm pretty much screwed. Oh, I got a patriarch, very dangerous game, okay, there he is. I mean, I don't recommend playing the support for the boss because the damage is just so freaking bad, man. I mean, it's not terrible for solo, but for multiplayer purposes, it's kind of like bad. Okay, let's just kill you like with the A12 now. Oh, I'm just like so freaking slow with... Oh god, that was a rocket. I'm just like so slow with like swapping and shit. I should make more things to swap in. And I do hate how the double barrel keeps firing by itself. Never appreciate it, man. Oh god, this does like massive damage to him. Oh, this, he's stuck. But I'm on 16 health, so it doesn't matter. Can I, can I kill you? Okay, this doesn't do like jack shit for damage. Okay, where do you even go? Okay, he's up there. Well, let's just wait for him to come back, I guess. You're a piece of shit, man. Can you just go? Oh god, he's got a machine gun out. And as long as I keep kiting him around this, I should be freaking fine. Oh, there he is. He's already on the orange phase. But where is he going? Okay, he's going upstairs. Well, rest in pieces, man. I mean, the boomstick against the boss... It can take ages, but it can be, like, kind of hilarious at the same time. I mean, just look at this, man. I can just, like, jump over him and stuff like that. He doesn't even know what's up. But I don't really like the support because the damage, it's just so bad with him. I mean, just look at this. It's not even doing, like, anything to him. Even, like, the A12, it's not doing, like, jack shit. Okay, let's run away from this. Or you just punch me. Works as well. But I do like how he can jump away from his stupid attacks. That's kind of neat. Oh, well... He's got his, like, mortar on, so that doesn't matter, I guess. Okay, let's hit you up. Get behind the freaking wall so you won't hit me with your stupid rockets there. Oh, well, time to run, man. Time to run. Oh, he's shooting me through the bushes. That cheeky shit. Okay, let's heal up now. And just, like, run away. Oh, that was near enough me dead. But not really. Okay, there we go. He's on his last freaking phase. Okay, Pecha. Oh, God, he's here. Oh, at least I can just do that and he can't even punch me, so that's kind of cool. Okay, let's heal myself up and... Oh, go behind the rock before he hits me with his stupid machine gun. Okay, there we go. I mean, the double barrel at least does, like, some damage to him. I can give it that. And he is demolished and I didn't even shoot that time because the double barrel just shoots by itself. Okay, and now I'm just going to show you what the other skin for the A12 looks like, and yeah, let's get right to it. This is how the other skin that I got in Mint, I think. Or was it Phil Test? I think it was actually Mint. Not entirely sure. Yeah, I think it's Mint. So this is like the only Mint thing that I got today in the unboxing, and it kind of looks like decent. I thought it looked like worse, but it's actually cool. And even the aim is like freaking orange and shit, so... I mean, but who even aims with the A12? I mean, what the hell? Okay, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Leave a like, subscribe, and see you guys next episode. Adios.